Hi, I'm Casey with Burkert Fluid Control Systems, and today I've got a new Burkert Quick Tip on how to repair a solenoid valve. In this case, we're using the type 6213. Now we're going to repair the type 6213. Remove the nut, the washer, and the seal, and slide the coil off of the body. Like the two type 255, there's another seal at the bottom of the plunger that you need to remove. Make sure not to confuse the two. Snap the plastic cover off of the body and then unscrew all four screws and remove the plunger. You will find two springs and the core attached to the diaphragm. In your repair kit, there's a main diaphragm assembled, two springs, and an O-ring. Place the main diaphragm on the valve body, but make sure that the bleed hole is facing the outlet port. Insert the small spring into the core and place the larger spring over the core. Carefully attach the plunger and replace the screws and then snap back on the plastic cover, but make sure that the arrow is facing the same way as the valve. Place back the seal on your plunger shaft that's provided in your kit and then put the coil back on top in the desired direction. Don't forget to put the seal tightly back inside then add your washer and your nut and now you've repaired your type 6213. Stay tuned for more Burkert Quick Tips. Thanks for watching. I'm Casey and have a great day.